Vedrafolner. What the? It is cold out there. But it's, uh, it's warm in here. Yeah, it's warm. So just a quick little blurb. Uh, I got one of those um, F4S all-in-one flight controllers with the 30 amp ESC, the F4 processor. Um, I got it mounted in this little uh, Floss 2 Floss 2 frame here with some Brother Hobby 20, 2206 2450 KV motors and um, this flight controller is the same as the uh, Vetterfun yeah, Vetterfunner oh Jesus Christ this one um, I got it from flip through, uh, from uh, ready to fly quads I know This is the same as the uh, Sunrise Siskin 30 amp, which is the same as the uh, Tattoo F4S Racer Star, same as the Multistar 30 amp, uh, I don't know, the Heli 32 thing, uh, same as the Luminaire Alpha all in one flight controller. They're all basically the same thing. Uh, 32 bit. Um, BL Heli 32 ESCs, and uh, what's going on with it? Um, it seems to be a reported problem. Is it doesn't seem to be too clean. So the build initially, uh, when I flew it, I had these crazy lines in the video, lines everywhere, lines, and um, I was getting pissed. And the quad was jerky. It was just, it was like in the air. It seemed like my pitch axis was like ten times higher than the rates I had it set for. It was flying all weird. Uh, it turns out I had a motor screw touching a winding, so I backed off the motor screw, um, and it was way better. The video cleaned up a lot, and but I, I still had a problem where it was twitchy. When I'd hover it, it would just like kind of do some weird stuff in the air. And uh, what? I ended up doing to fix it was I went into Beal Heli Beal Beal Heli 32, and I uh, upped the PW PWM frequency from um, 24, I think it's the default, to 48, and everything smoothed out. It just smoothed out, and um, the quad flew pretty damn good, and now it flies pretty damn good. Um, it will get dirty quick though. If you mess up a prop, it'll start flying like shit. Uh, but you have to be pretty messed up, I think. Um, but the quad handle's good. This thing weighs um, 275 grams uh, like this, which I feel like it should be less. Um, but the flight controller is like, it's kind of heavy. It's like 30 something grams, I think, or 28 or 26 grams. I don't know, they all listed differently. Why can't they all do it the same? I don't know. But, uh, so, yeah, the, I'm pretty happy with the flight controller for the money. It's like around 70 bucks, 75 bucks, 65 bucks, 60 bucks, depending where you get it. And you get Beal Heli 32 ESCs, 30 amp, um, and an F4 flight controller all in one with cam control and all that garbage. Well, Use the LED strip for cam control. Um, can't get the smart audio to work, but I know people have done it. I think it's actually the tramp that I'm using with the tramp protocol. I can't really get it to work good. Anyway, um, for the money for 60 bucks for ESCs and a flight controller, 70 bucks, it's pretty good. Not bad for a cheap quad. And uh, if you blow it up, you know. You blow it up. I've crashed it pretty hard. Haven't wrecked it yet. It's dirty though. Like it's got some dirt in there. Yeah. Look at that. Dirty. Those standoffs are listing a little to the right, like that. But uh, she still flies good. So, yeah, 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 yeah. Slow 
around. 